Yeah, trendsetter. Whoa, league of my own, it don't get better. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our channel. And we, it is Sunday, and it is time to head back to my in laws. Oh, who is that weirdo? <laughs> so, I'm gonna take a quick walk because there is Ralphster. See him there? So, yeah, we're gonna take a little walk today and wait for our friends to wake up. And um, that's actually, let's see if I can get a shot of them there. That's my friend's truck. And that is there. He works at a company called ROA. And uh, he's allowed to take their RVs and stuff and get them demonstrated and make sure that they're all working really well. So I'm gonna try to do a tour of it at some point before we leave, but we'll see. It's kind of up to them. Um, I mentioned my friend Randy. I've, I've known Randy since, uh, since we were kids, pretty much. I mean, we, we've known each other since high school. So it's been over 30 years now, which is crazy. And it's so awesome that he's still in my life. And, um, you know, I don't, I say he's my friend and all stuff, but he's really like a brother to me. We've been through so much together. Um, you know, marriage and raising kids and just, just so much. And even before all that stuff, all the stuff that we did before all that. So, yeah, so he, he's like a brother to me and, you know, I love him to death. So, and, uh, you know, I was excited to see him. We hadn't seen him in a couple of years and, uh, him and his wife, Christina. So we got to see them and, uh, it was awesome to see him. So, yeah, so we're going to be heading back home today and it is so quiet again. I was, when I walked through this place yesterday with Ralph, as you guys saw in the video, and it looks like there's a lot of people here, but there really isn't. It's like people leave. Yeah. The people leave their RVs here. So I don't know how that works because, I mean, I think it was, I think it's 50 bucks a night to stay here. And even during the peak season, it was 50 bucks. I saw on the website, Hope said. So maybe they do like weekly rates or monthly rates for them. I don't know. But there's a bunch of them here. Like all these right here, there's not a single person in any of those. All the way around. So, and, even, and the one that's next to us, um, that there was no one there either. So not sure. I don't know if people just leave them here for the winter and then every once in a while peek in. So I don't know if you guys know, or if you do something like that, where you leave your RV at a, uh, at a campground instead of putting it in storage or something, uh, let us know. I'm, I'd be interested to know about that. Cause I, I don't know, you know, like I said, if it's weekly rates or monthly rates or something like that. And some of them even have like a, a porch and stuff like that, that they, canopies yeah, and canopies yeah. and all that stuff. So I, it's like they built onto it. No. So yeah, pretty cool. It is cold. Yes. It was uh, 27 degrees when we woke up this morning and uh, I disconnected the water last night. So we don't have to worry about that this morning. I had plenty of water in our tank. So just got to unhook the uh, power and the black tank and um, we'll be out of here soon but hope's already ready to start heading back because it's cold and uh i am too so we'll do a video before as we're starting to leave this is my friend randy's truck so his is campingrandy.com and yeah the company that he works for is called roa off-road and uh, he works there. It's uh, located somewhere. I think it's in Greenville, South Carolina. And this is the stuff that they sell. So it's similar to this. And I believe this is a 2024 model. XT16HR. And it is really nice. I'll show you the back end of it. So what's cool is it comes with this thing here and it's like an extension and they're sleeping so I don't want to bug them. But So he put a heater in there and it's like an extension and it's like a living room in there. It was awesome and it was really nice and um, so modern in the inside too. It's really nice but I thought that was really cool. So I just wanted to show you guys that. And here we are. So like I said, I disconnected the water last night. So I just need a couple things to remove, the power and all that stuff. You guys can hear the, there's a really nice house back there. You can hear the water running. It's 
so nice. Hey everyone, so it is Monday and so clearly we're back. Hope's back to work, that's all her stuff from work. But I wanted to show you guys that my father-in-law did the Murphy desk or Murphy table, whatever you want to call it. And it is awesome. I wanted to make sure I posted so you guys can see it. Um, these legs are just for support right now, but we can actually remove them. And um, the table, there's just two hinges underneath there. And then all you do is just clip both of those hinges and the table goes up against the wall. And just show you a little bit of video of my father-in-law, you know, doing a little bit of the work on this. So, so appreciate him and all the work that he did. And so what we do is, um, you know, Monday through Friday when Hope's working, that stuff is there. But um, it's really easy to kind of take down. And then she's got the boxes up there. So we put it away on the weekend and, you know, we put our stuff there. We can eat whatever we want there. Um, but it gives us so much room in here. It's so awesome. And really, again, appreciate what uh, my father-in-law getting that all done. Um, I had a great time talking about the, the trip that we made to uh, the campsite and we actually met some cool people there uh, Tim and Don it was so nice meeting y'all and what was cool we found out that um, Tim actually went to the high school that Randy and I graduated from back in 89 he graduated in 84 but he went to the same high school so what are the chances you know we're out in the middle of nowhere Georgia and here's one of our uh, uh, you know guy that went to the same high school that we went to in Florida so crazy stuff but anyway it was a great time. Um, glad to be back. And guys, we've got some big news coming. So stay tuned. Super excited. We're just kind of wrapping some things up and making sure everything is fine tuned before we put it out there. But big news coming. So stay tuned. Uh, please do me a favor. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you all again for your support. And we will talk to you soon. Take care.